Hello friends! Today you'll see how actors of the movie True Lies have changed. You'll know the original names and age. I will show you how they looked then in 1994 and what's with them now in 2021. Don't forget to like and subscribe to the channel. Let's go! Dana Tasker, Eliza Dushku, is a teenage girl, the daughter of Harry Tasker. She is kidnapped by terrorists led by Salim Abu Aziz. Her father, Harry, rescues her. Eliza Dushku made her acting debut in 1992 with the film That Night, at the age of 10. After the success of her first film, Dushku was cast in several other leading productions by famous directors. Her breakthrough, however, came through television. After appearing as a slayer in Buffy the Vampire Slayer, she became a global phenomenon at a young age. Albert Gibson, Tom Arnold, is a partner and friend of Harry Tusker. He is also a spy, a special agent for a secret organization called the Omega Sector, which is fighting terrorist organizations. Tom Arnold is a popular and versatile actor comedian who has had a roller coaster career in Hollywood. After having worked as a meat packer, box stacker, bartender, and bouncer in his youth, Arnold finally found his calling in stand-up comedy. His self-belief and ambition first took him in Minneapolis and subsequently to Hollywood. Jonas Skinner, Tia Carrere, was an antiquities dealer who was working for terrorists by collecting information for their organization with her pretty appearance. She also helped smuggle arms into the U.S. by placing them into ancient artifacts. Althea Gennaro, who is widely known by her professional name Tia Carrere, known for her role in the film Wayne's World, as well as its sequel Wayne's World 2. After her success in movies, she also pursued her interests in singing. Her talents in singing have also earned her two Grammy Awards. Salim Abu Aziz, he played by Art Mali, head of a group of Islamic terrorist organizations called Scarlet Jihad, which aims to explode a nuclear warhead in America for oppressing his country and kill Harry Tasker. Art Malik is a Pakistani English actor who achieved international fame in the 1980s through his starring and subsidiary roles in assorted British and Merchant Ivory television series and films. He is especially remembered as the doomed Harry Kumar in The Jewel in the Crown and the outset of his career. Simon, Bill Paxton, seduces Helen with the lie that he is a secret agent. He is really a used car salesman. Harry suspects Helen is cheating on him with Simon. Harry and Albert gave Simon a lesson after that he scrapped one's pants. Bill Paxton starting off as a sad dresser. Did he know that his life would change overnight and he will be treading the path of stardom? He is best known for his roles in Apollo 13, Twister, Titanic and the television series Big Love. In 2017, Paxton died of a stroke. Faisal, Grand Haslow is an employee of a special agency called the Omega Sector, which fights against terrorist organizations. He worked in a team with Harry Tasker and helped to eliminate a group of terrorists of Salim Abu Aziz. Grant Haslow, known for his producing and writing collaborations with George Clooney, which have earned him four Oscar nominations. As a co-producer of Argo, he received the Academy Award for Best Picture in 2013. As an actor, he has appeared in films including Black Sheep, Enemy of the State, etc. Yusif, one of the members of a group of Islamic terrorist organizations. He was supposed to be shot by Harry Tasker in the closet, but Harry was trickier and stronger, defeating him in hand-to-hand -hand combat. Yusuf is portrayed by actor Ofer Samra. Not much is known about this actor except that he played minor characters. Ofer Samra is an artist, painter, and actor who has resided in Venice, California. Samra is also active as a film producer, screenwriter, and fitness and lifestyle coach.
Allison is a co-worker of Helen Tasker. She has a very insignificant role. She appears only a few times on the film and for a very short time. She is supported by Katzi Chappell. Katzi Chappell is an American actress and comedian. She is supported one of the nurses in Inspector Gadget. Spencer Trilby is the head of the special agency called the Omega Sector, which fights against terrorist organizations, in which Harry Tasker also works. He's supported by Charlton Heston. As a Hollywood star, he appeared in almost 100 films over the course of 60 years. He played Moses in the epic film The Ten Commandments, 1956, for which he received his first nomination for the Golden Globe Award for Best Actor in Motion Picture Drama and Ben-Hur, 1959, for which he won the Oscar for Best Actor. Janice Jane Morris is one of the minor actors and employees of the agency called the Omega Sector. She sits at the checkpoint and makes sure that no one else gets into the building. Jane Morris played the recurring role of Nora O'Doherty, a co-worker and oftentimes nemesis of Drews in seasons 1-9 of The Drew Carey Show, first appearing in the episode Nature Evers A Vacuum. In addition to her appearances on TDCS, Jane has also guest starred on many TV shows which include Lewis and Clark, The New Adventures of Superman. Harry Tusker, Arnold Schwarzenegger, is an international spy. Harry has been living a double life as a family man and an international spy in the US government for counter-terrorist agency called the Omega Sector fighting terrorist organizations. Schwarzenegger rose to fame as the world's top bodybuilder, launching a career that would make him a giant Hollywood star via films like Conan the Barbarian, The Terminator. After years of blockbuster movie roles, Schwarzenegger went into politics, becoming governor of California. Helen Tusker, she played by Jamie Lee Curtis, is the wife of Harry Tusker. Helen and their daughter Dana believe that Harry is the computer salesman, not knowing he really works for the secret Omic sector. She becomes bored in her suburban housewife life. Actress Jamie Lee Curtis came to formerly known as Baroness Lady Hayden Guest, following her husband's inheritance of the barony. Her debut film, Halloween, where she essayed the role of Laurie Strode, was a hit and establishing her as a noted actress in the horror genre. Thank you for watching. If you like this video, please share it on social networks, like it, and of course, subscribe to the channel.